Remember this video of Will Smith eating spaghetti. This AI generated video of Will Smith is of 2023 and now we are at this. There is big big difference in both of these. From low resolution and less frame rate video to a HD quality and visually appealing thing. It has changed a lot in less than a year. OpenAI just introduced Sora, a text to video model that can generate videos up to a minute long while maintaining visual quality and adherence to user's prompt. Well, there are various video generation models that are available today, but Sora is built something different. So let's see some of the capabilities of Sora that makes it superior. Before I show you these videos, you have to keep in mind that you are watching AI generated content and it won't be as good as movie. So compare it only with its predecessor rather than a movie. Sora can create realistic scenes from user's text prompt. The prompt given for this scene is a stylish woman walks down a Tokyo street filled with warm glowing neon and animated city. Looking at the quality of the video, no doubt it's amazing. But look at the details, the neon light, city background. You can clearly see reflection on road due to the water. And the physics behind walking is way right than the other video generation model. And there are certain flaws like you can see the man behind in white is sliding down the road. But never mind, 10 months before we were at this and now we are here. It's absolutely amazing. Now look at this video. The camera follows behind a white vintage SUV with a black roof rack as it speeds up a steep dirt road. And again, this is amazing. But this kind of gives a feeling of video game type because it certainly looks real but the car and the environments look similar to that. How about this video? New York City, so much like Atlantis, fish, whales and sea turtles. Looking at this video feels fake because the physics of motion of fish is random. All of them are moving in different directions and some of the fish feels like they are dead. OpenAI have released various videos and I have gone through all of them. Some of them are good while others have some flaws. But if you read OpenAI's technical paper, then they have clearly mentioned what this model is capable of. So let's check those one by one. Sora is capable of animating your DAL E images. It turns this image of dog into this moving cool video. Let's see another one. This image to videos is pretty amazing. And I'm sure if this is true, as far as other models are concerned, then no other model is able to generate this kind of result. Connecting videos Sora can gradually interpolate between two input videos. Two input videos of any subject and the result video will be a seamless transition of the input. So these were some of the things that I liked from the technical paper. And now let's talk about the limitation. Sora has some weaknesses in generating videos of complex scenes simulating physics. Have a look at this video. Did you notice that? This man is running in opposite direction on the treadmill, which isn't an ordinary way to run. This model often gets confused with motion simulating physics. Check this. Five grey wolf pups are chasing each other. And you will notice that the new pups are spontaneously appearing in the video from nowhere. Now look at this. This grandma is celebrating her birthday with her family and all looks good but when you will see from close then all the flame of candles are going in different direction one more have a look at the hand of the woman behind it's making a random movement and it's distorted so to conclude this model faced some difficulties in generating hands complex scene including physics motion and sometimes a new character get appears in the video from nowhere and this model is a live example of that Think about the possibilities what this model can do in the upcoming future. It's hard to digest, but the future will be dark when you are unable to differentiate between the real things and virtual stuff. The negative impact on people's mind and body will increase to a far extent. That's it for the video and please subscribe to the channel. Many of you have not subscribed yet. I'll meet you in the next video. Bye-bye.